Subscribe to Femina and press the bell icon. Hi. Today we are going to show you mutton shikampur kebab. I will take you through the ingredients which are needed for this recipe. Mutton about 350 grams. It is boneless. Chana dal which has been soaked for about an hour, about 100 grams of it. Black cardamom, green cardamom, cloves, black pepper, cinnamon, cumin, bay leaf and some dry red chilies. Green chilies, some green stems of coriander, ginger, garlic, mint. turmeric powder red chili powder and salt for the stuffing we will be needing hung yogurt brown onions some chopped onions chopped green chilies chopped coriander and chopped mint leaves I'm adding a little bit of turmeric powder, red chili powder, salt. So we have to simmer it for very long time, about 20-25 minutes. Till the time the mutton is cooked, the dal is cooked, and we are able to blend all the ingredients together. So as you can see our mutton is cooked the dal is cooked and water is nearly evaporated so at this stage we will take out all the ingredients put it into a tray and keep for cooling before we start grinding by the time our mutton mixture is cooling let us make filling for the shikampur kebab so here we are taking hung curd i have put a little bit of green chilies chopped onions go into this brown onions coriander chopped some chopped mint leaves little bit of salt we will all mix these ingredients and make a filling we will apply it well into a round ball we will make a small insert into the ball fill in the stuffing here and close them into making a patty again we are going to shallow fry them later so i have heated a non stick pan here putting little bit of oil for shallow frying at a time for frying these are very very delicate so needs to be handled very softly so let the patties cook from one side have a even brown color and then we will turn them around to give color on the next side so once they are evenly cooked and brown from both the sides they are ready to be dished let us start plating our kebabs Garnish it with a sprig of coriander and serve with mint chutney. <laughs> 